Most High God, we are here in front of you, asking for your gracious blessing. Keep our faith in your providence, knowing that you will never forsake nor abandon us. We are not asking for a luxurious life. Instead, we are just praying to have enough to live on in our everyday life. Your word says that we should not worry. So we are holding on to our faith and to your promises that your abundance will be showered upon us all our life. You know what we need, and we trust that we will receive it. Heavenly Father, there is a pain implanted in my heart that doesn't seem to go away. It has crushed me. It aches. I can no longer bear it. This pain of the past consumes my thoughts daily. It hurts so much, Father. These tears that fall long to see joy once again. Give me peace in my heart. Please, I'm crying out to you. Hear my prayer. In Jesus' name, Amen. He showed no mercy on that nation, which he doomed to destruction for its sins, nor on those 600,000 people on the march through the wilderness who gathered together in stubborn rebellion. Even if there had been only one stubborn person, it would have been a miracle if he had escaped punishment. The Lord is merciful, but he can also become angry. He can be overwhelming in his forgiveness or in his anger. His punishment is as severe as His mercy is great. He judges people by what they have done. No sinner can escape with what he has stolen. The Lord will reward patience or devout people. Every righteous person will be rewarded. Every will get what he deserves. Never say, I will hide from the Lord. Nobody out there is going to give me a thought. How can I be noticed among so many people? The creation is so enormous, what am I worth? When the Lord comes, everything will tremble. The earth and the great waters beneath it, the sky and the heavens above it, the mountains will shake, and the foundations of the earth will shudder. When he looks at him, the Lord isn't going to give me a thought. Nobody cares what I do if I sin, and I'm secretly disloyal. Nobody will know it. If I know what is right, nobody will tell the Lord about it. Who wants to wait for him away anyway? He is too slowly in doing what he has said. He would. Only someone with very little sins and foolishly misguided will think things like that.